Eclipse is the one that's going to be right up on top of the speed. Pretty timed. Uh, the just little slight query I had with him is he's yet to win past 1,400 metres. Three, seven, five and six. Really interesting market, isn't it? Because you've also got the lightly raced high dandy lining up for start nine here, which has been kept nice and safe around that eight or nine dollar mark. And even Rod Northam's horse has been supported into, into that double, oh, that, into that ten dollar quote. Well, both of those have got great chances. Um, high dandy covered ground uh, last time out and uh, had genuine excuses. Still only finished um, uh, three lengths there off Firestorm. I thought it was a nice effort. And as for, for Rod Northam's horse, it was a tremendous in defeat last time out, um, charging home into, into second spot at Randwick behind uh, Well Timed. And you would think that Dubbo's a sort of track where uh, he could really excel. He's one from one here already. Yeah, exactly right. Really interesting edition of the Dubbo Cup. We've got 440 about your favourite uh, Hollywood hero being backed late. It's into $4.60. 480, the third favourite. So 40 cents separates the first three in the market and then you've got Chris Waller fourth favourite um, 440 460 480 $6 for his call of the 2024 edition of the Dubbo Cup here's Cole to race in Queensland it's won about a dozen races now back with Peter Nestor at Dubbo Smooth as free about to come up Sharp Shocks back behind them with Osman Mars a bit, touch of Navy won the Dubbo Cup prelude which gained an entry into the race. Vivi is still to come in with High Dandy and Mars a bit. I'll just have a look, it was blowing a bit, Mars a bit. Uh, we'll just have a look at the market, blowing in the betting I should say. Number five, it's $6 now, Mars a bit. It's got out, uh, Madatsu I should say, madatsu has got out from uh, 460 out to, it's come back uh, to $6, Madatsu. So, uh, Vincenzo Ella Drew's been giving her chance here, the three kilogram climbing apprentice. She's now with Scott Singleton, the trainer, and uh, she's been running quite a few winners lately, but she's been giving her chance in the Dubbo Cup on Vincenzo. Madatsu's about to come up, waiting on Vivier. Vincenzo drawn wide, sharp shock, high dandy. They're lining up pretty well now. Big crowd to watch the cup. They come out of a shoot here at the 1600. And there's three to come in. High Dandy, Sharp Shock, and Vincenzo. I've been trying. Thunder Lips drawn down on the inside. Aim Point also drawn in close. Here comes Vincenzo. And Sharp Shock will be the last one in a capacity field of 16. In the cup and waiting on Sharp Shock to complete the lineup. Big crowd here that promoted this meeting very, very well. And a lot of people were pretty thrilled to see Gallant Star win the Vincent Gordon flying. He's off to the Kosciuszko now, the local horse trained by Brett Robb. In comes Sharp Shock, he's got the barrier blanket on. And he'll be the last one in, and they're almost set to go now for the. Dubbo Cup, 16 to run, all in the barriers, stand by, about to go here, the barriers have been filled and the starter holds them, red lights on. Off and racing with Shinzo, jumped away well with touch of Navy and Osmond's going up pretty quickly. Thunderlips is right through along the rails, but going fast, Rajnish will lead. Rajnish is going to lead from High Dandy coming across and Osmond's handy. Thunderlips on the rails with Chenzo is over on the outside of them. Followed then by Aim Point, who's back about six. Then came I've Been Trying. Touch of Navy was next over on the inside. Sneak preview. Joined there by by Hollywood Hero as they hit down the back. Getting back there was just a brother. Vivier goes around them. A smoother spree's a fair way back as they thunder down the back. Sharp shock. And last of all was Madatsu. So they come on the side and High Dandy leads now. Moving up on the outside was Vincenzo and Vincenzo raced to the lead over High Dandy. Five lengths back to Osman. Followed then by Rajnis. Aim point goes forward. Thunder lips about six and touch of Navy, Hollywood Hero trying to get a run, Vivier back behind them, Smoother Spree, just a brother, 
Sneak previews, sharp shock out wide. And Madatsu is a long way off them. Vincenzo halfway down the straight, the leader. Hi Dandy, here's Osman. Sneak previews putting in a run. On the outside now, Osman. Sneak previews trying to get a run. It was blocked there. Hi Dandy on the inside. Vincenzo's fighting back. And Sneak preview is sweeping on the outside. And Hollywood Hero is flying. They come to the line. Sneak preview. Sneak preview has won from Hi Dandy out wide. Hollywood Hero, Thunder Lips and Madatsu was flying through along the rails from a mile back. Vincenzo's run a great race. Followed in there by Osman. Then came Smooth Esprit, Thunder Lips. Followed in by Aim Point. Then came Touch of Navy. A fair way back then to Sharp Shock and Raj Nish. And the locals were cheering. Sneak preview. Back at Dubbo, the jockey only just recently resumed riding after a long break. Cody Nesta, and he rides it. Fairy tales do come true in racing. Sneak preview, ridden by his former trainer, Cody Nesta, for his uncle, Peter Nesta. And goes around at 100 to 1, wins the Dubbo Cup for 2024. They might have to put the uh, retirement plans on ice because they're eligible for the little dance and the big dance.